Alright, haven't been to the right yet. Let's go over to the right. Since there's no other way to go, because they've locked all the friggin' doors. I, uh, oh, there we go. That pressed the button. Okay, so now that opens up that shortcut. Back to there. Good, good. See, in a dungeon, I can fucking get shit done. Jun. See, it's, it's a clever, it's a clever wordplay joke. That's far too generous. Okay. Maybe if I push this here block, something will happen. Do I have to push it onto this? I am almost 100% certain that that's what I have to do. Come block. Press this switch for me. Do my bidding. <laughs> oh, yes. Oh, God, no. That was a straight up bloodstained hand. That was a little bit. Ugh. I am so glad I have this bow. But I can't get that door open. It's not a kill all the enemies deal because I think these are. Alright! Call me a liar and you would be right. Those are spikes. Alright, so that's not where we go yet. Oh! Oh! Oh, okay. I thought I was having to walk across them. I see. Sort of. You just have to be patient. You gotta hurt. That one's from a bit of grass, so I don't know why it felt the need to do the dun and -dun -dun for that. But yeah, this is easy enough. Just walk when the spikes are not. And you will find your destiny. Uh, Alright. They, they do a fair bit of damage. I might not want to fuck about too much with those. Do these move? That one does. And that one does. Oh, I see. It's to make it easier to get past. I don't think it's a direct puzzle. That's totally fine. By me. Yeah, you see, I'm definitely going to be draining the water. Look at that. Couldn't be more obvious if they tried. Let's go southward. I've got a good feeling about south. Let's not cut that grass. That sounds like an idea, doesn't it? Now, these ones feel like they're infinitely respawning. But I've been wrong before. So the chances are I'll be wrong again. Come back to that door in a second. I just wanted to look over here first. Feels like there should be something here. Given that this is otherwise a dead end. Die, bear! You're not allowed to wear a dressing gown. Your privileges have been revoked. Nah, come on. There's something else in this room. There's gotta be. Maybe it wants me to bomb something? Maybe it wants me to bomb this statue? Maybe it wants me to bomb... Oh, yeah, it did. It just didn't do the... -na 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 -na. Cool. Maybe this will drain the water? Doink! Malus has solved the puzzle with his sword. I mean, I'm assuming it's a two-way switch because this is going to close off certain other areas. In a way, I hope it's not a two-way switch because I'd like that to be just a one-and-done thing. But yeah, so now we can get down to that area. And if we press this here button, we can lower those blacks. Oh, we can't go down there. Alright. Uh, what was I going to do? Oh yeah, there's a, there was a treasure chest back that way that was uh, I was prevented to getting to because of the water. So let's get it now. And again, an empty one. I don't really know why they're doing that. you got 20 arrows. Not tremendously useful, but I'll take it. I really want the map. Having both the map and the compass would make me feel a lot more comfortable with this whole thing. Can I go back there? I can. Doesn't really lead to anything, though. Okay, not a problem. How many times will Malice say not a problem in this episode? Probably quite a few. Yeah, that whole treasure chest closing thing is really irritating. Especially in a dungeon, I think doubly so. I think it's really going to screw you up. Oh god! 
Woof, no need to panic. Not yet. It's directing us this way, so let's go this way. That's how you get down into the water. Not water anymore. Into the what was once water, but is no longer that. Okay, well, we just opened this way, so I feel like we should go this way. Oh, doesn't actually lead to anything. I mean, presumably at some point we're going to be able to use those. Maybe you can only climb up them, but not go down them? Which would seem an ass-backwards way of it working, but... No, in fact, you just can't go through them at all. Whoops. Uh, let's try a bomb. Bombs solve most problems that arrows don't. But not this one. Okay, fine. Don't even care. Let's go back this way, then. See if uh, draining the water has uncovered any other secrets. Not as such, no. Cool. Well, there's a set of stairs there that are just begging to be travelled down. So let's do that. How about... Yeah, there we go. Oh, that's looking a bit more promising, ain't it? Okay, so these blocks have arrows on them. So they can only be pushed in one direction. Clever. At least they have the decency to show you that, because some blocks in older Zelda games, particularly Link's Awakening, to the best of my recollection, had blocks like this, but there was no way to tell that you could only move them one way. Also, this switch here doesn't seem to... Unless you can move it more than once. Let's try that. Yeah, yeah, you can. Okay, good. So for this one, we would need probably this block here. So if we move that one there, and then this one here, and then this one here, and subsequently this one to here. Yes! Puzzle solver! Extreme! And that is me. And that's how I roll. Down a hill. Solving puzzles. Okay, no. Not going that way yet. It's gated off now. It's totally fine now. Get out the way now. Oh, please stop bothering me. That looks... Yep, deadly. I thought so. Well, at least I can kill him. And can I hit that switch from here with my bow and arrow? You're damn right. See, once I'm in the dungeon, I hit my element, I know what to fucking do. Because, you know, there's only certain things it could be, in most cases. And uh, having arrows is very handy for dealing with most problems. I've hidden the door there. I feel so much more comfortable in a dungeon when playing a Zelda. Because again, it's, it's a finite set of paths and instructions. Where the floor? Why? What's it going to do? Is it going to collapse on me? Is there any way to tell which ones will collapse and which ones won't? Probably. I feel like if I go down the more obvious way, that is definitely going to be a trap. So let's not... Oh no! Oh no! I did a bad. Well, I mean it was to be expected. I didn't actually go this way in the first place, I don't think. So maybe this will get me the map. I mean, that would certainly help a lot if I could find it. This is probably it right here. No? Well, arrows are always handy, so yeah. I'll take them. Why can't I break these pots? I don't know. This is definitely a Link's Awakening thing. Where well, you can't break the pots, you have to lift them. Okay. These blocks don't seem like they move. Hmm. What do you want from me here, game? Maybe I can bomb that? It doesn't look as beaten up as the previous one. No. Uh, not the solution. Yeah, they definitely don't move. I feel like there's some relevance to this, though. That is very mysterious. Oh well, damned if I know what it is. We'll come back later for that one.
Maybe the water needs to be different? I don't know. Let's check up here. Where does this lead? Oh, it undid the water switch. Damn it. Well, okay. Well, that's that's why we have that switch, right? That suggests that that switch is a two-way deal. Let's test it anyway, since I'm back here. Bear in the dressing gown. Don't do a whole heart of damage to me. I don't appreciate your tendency towards murder. The fact that it reverted it suggests that it can just be done manually. But I want to be sure. Let's just test it. I need to know if I'm going to need to flick it back. Yes, okay, it can, and therefore probably will need to be flipped back. At least it doesn't show the whole damn scene each time. Oh, it does. Alright, well I know I needed that done, so that's fine. Solving puzzles all day. You can't solve puzzles as well as me. I'm some kind of solving master. With all the skills that are required. In this fucking temple. Perhaps it's of doom. Did I go uh, this way? I don't know if I did, but... I mean, I didn't. But I can't- OH GOD! Pot attack! I'm getting the feeling that the item from this dungeon might be the raft, or the whatever it is. I'd like to believe it's a jet ski. First. And foremost... I guess we're gonna go back here. He doesn't come to life straight away. Whoa! Oh god! Shouldn't have walked into him. That was a mistake. Please don't kill me. With your plasma beam. You don't have one of those. Die, please. You know Whoa! What? Kind of a dick move that they don't come to life until you touch them, and those ones were behind the waterfall, so they were hard to see. Could really go for a heart right about now. Alright, let's just go as fast through this as we- DAMN IT! So that's not the solution either. Hmm... 